Hello and welcome to my very first time-lapse video of Space Mountain and also to my very first YouTube video which I do a commentary on so please forgive me for any mistakes and for all the unprofessional um, aspect of this recording um, I know sound quality isn't the best, I know my English isn't the best um, forgive me, I'm German so I think we German are known for not having the best English out there um, but as many people from the Facebook group have requested this video, and I guess not all people do understand German, I, I sh I've um, decided to do it in English, and um, yeah, uh, anyway, I'm, I'm not feeling too comfortable with doing this now, um, but yeah, I, I, I'll be trying it out, um, I'll, be, I'll be popping it out to the public, there's no problem with, with this. So let's see what it will be in the end. Um, yeah, originally I planned to release the time lapse without any commentary, but watching it uh, here, I figure out it's kind of boring. Just with the music, 11 minutes, uh, just watching the time lapse is kind of boring. So I thought, yeah, maybe try it. Just speak something into your microphone, which isn't the best. Yeah, I know. Uh, as I already said, um, yeah. So this is the first time lapse. As you can see, nothing special going around in the background. I'm just setting up the basic um, layout of the dome, and then just um, putting some. Uh, supports to the sides of um, of the building just to have first of all it's um, kind of looks great and the other one to make it feel a little bit more like uh, in the real uh, world um, and yeah besides uh, some notes um, I'm, I'll be building the uh, Disneyland Paris version of the Space Mountain not the one in the United States um, it's uh, the one on just that's funny. I mean, not the one uh, in the world, Disney World, or, or not the one in California. It's the one in uh, Paris. So yeah, because they are more in the United States. Um, yeah, here also nothing special. I'm doing the wood supports to it. Um, I've decided to take um, the wooden parts um, for the most uh, part of this of this building because um, in the real space mount uh, Paris. There is, um, I guess it's metal, like mat metal patterns uh, also going from left to right. I'm not sure about that, but uh, I thought the wooden patterns here came came um, very close to what it is uh, in the original version. Unfortunately, there's no possibility to, to change the color of them. So um, yeah, uh, I just choose to, to take the wooden one. I will, I will do some elements to uh, make it a little bit more like the realistic one, like some some decoration in the end, but uh, this is it. So yeah, after I've, I've um, done the basic um, tube, I wanted to figure out how it will be work with the boost. Um, not knowing at this stage that the, the boost isn't working in this alpha build, so yeah, I'm just messing around with the layout, not knowing that it will won't work. And so uh, please forgive me for for this, but I thought maybe I just leave it in because it's like failing all the time um, and not knowing that it isn't working. Um, maybe it is working and I've just uh, missed how it will work, but anyway, there I stopped it and just continued building um, the the uh, tube. And, uh, the tube will come later, but here building the globe and um, now continuing with the um, connection between what is the station in the final version and uh, the dome uh, inside. Um, yeah, this is kind of a really easy building, just one building with another on top to, to fit between these glasses, which I really don't know why, but if you just put glasses together, these glass glass roof, roofs here um, in the in one building, they don't fit together, and I don't know why. There, there's a little space between them, and I haven't figured out why there is, so um, just I, I've put the these um, metal bars between so to, to close the gap um, and yeah then um, now I'm, I'm I figure out that there is something really strange here as you can see um, I couldn't place the glass roof um, at the same high as in the other buildings um, until now I haven't figured out why it is the case because all other elements I've tried to place in, in one high will work after a time. Sometimes you have to place it again on the bottom and it will work afterwards, but in this case it really hasn't worked at all, so I have chosen to just um, find another solution, which was the first solution which gave me also um, a hint how I could do the roof in the end. Uh, so I took those those bluish metal bars here um, and assembled them in a triangle um, with some other elements, like bigger blue elements in the end. Um, it, it worked out pretty well, but 
to be honest. I hope that we will have in, in future builds the possibility to um, uh, maybe scale some things or maybe have um, some elements which can be dragged in every direction like in every shape and uh, so on because this was really frustrating here trying around with um, all these all these bigger assets here and it kind of looks good in the end but uh, honestly I don't know how many elements are already in this here just for the roof and um, as, as I've already said on Facebook and on, uh, here on YouTube uh, the performance in the end was really crap um, I, I know I, I think the game wasn't intended to to pump in as much objects I, 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 wrote, I did um, but to be honest it really was like um, at the beginning here you can see under um, and a recording, um, I went up to. Uh, and I guess I locked it at uh, 30 FPS because in the in the beginning um, of of Planet Coaster Alpha, I had around 70, 80 FPS. Um, and yeah, after after the building was set and um, everything worked, I got to 18 FPS. I said, um, I think, and this is really well, yeah, a drop of FPS, which is really unlikely because. Um, yeah, this was the only bigger building here in the, in the park. Um, I had some other buildings here, but not like um, putting in objects uh, like I did here. So yeah, um, yeah. Going on with uh, some explanations in the background here, you can see I'm, I'm doing the basic um, layout of the roof. Um, and there it is also important that I've chosen to take um, these wall elements with always two walls because then I could take the middle axis to um, put on the roof uh, support here. Um, in the beginning I thought maybe I should do um, three walls at, at each part for the for the dome but um, it, it kind of uh, felt like it will be too big in the end and yeah and doing the roof I also noticed yeah it would have been uh, a little bit uh, problematic if I um, would have chosen to take a three uh, walls next to each other because then there wouldn't have been a middle axis like you can see here with these blue elements I put them uh, on both sides and it really didn't work out because uh, it just Didn't work out like a triangle. I will remove them later on because they don't fit to together and So yeah afterwards I started um, to to think of the um, tube which will go up the up the hill and um, just to be honest, but this is one point which is important for all the following episodes also. Um, this is not a video where I've tested a lot of things before and then built the final one. It is really on the fly. I've, uh, in the video you will always see like I'm failing several times with several buildings. And, uh, also with this one here. Unfortunately, um, you will see now um, a little gap after doing this here because I don't know why I, I just failed to stop or start again recording and um, so the whole th the whole time where I have really built these um, these parts for the um, tube are, are missing unfortunately um, yeah you can see um, but you can see the basic idea how, how I did the um, tube um, yeah it is kind of working out pretty well but in the end um, this might be also a factor of for dropping FPS and, and, and strange performance because as you can see now um, there is yeah really a lot of parts and a lot of objects just for the tube going up the hill um, I guess there are around two thousands of these um, just uh, uh, concrete bars um, just to, to make this looking like a tube and really I guess uh, the game was not intended to uh, work with these elements like this like all the all the people do like Ramona and and Silverette, and I hope I pronounced the guys correctly, um, all of them using so many um, different buildings going into each other to make a good looking building in the end. And um, I don't know if the guys from Frontier have planned that we will uh, take all the parts and do it like this, but if they have planned so, it would be great if they can um, improve the performance in the end, like uh, for example, having some um, hiding elements, like if. If there is a wall which you can't uh, see through, then maybe that all other elements um, behind the wall are um, just deactivated or something like this. Because I, I, I guess this would give us a, a, a huge performance boost for all these great buildings um, that be made out there by the community. Um, really, this game, um, also to make a point there, it is absolutely amazing for an alpha. I mean, I, I haven't, I've played a lot of AA plus titles which have been 
really worse than this one here. And this is only an alpha and this is really a great thing. Of course there are some things which are still strange and uh, which have to be improved and there are so many possibilities in this game. Um, and opportunities as well for the future builds um, and I hope they bring in a, like a really good um, editor for the coaster like uh, colors and, and columns styles and and like support styles and all these stuff um, but really also in this early stage and I know uh, coasters aren't really in the alpha as well it's just um, like a cheat activating to have coasters but also they're working pretty well and to be honest they work better than they do in RCTW, uh, RCTW, sorry, German, um, uh, in the early access of Rollercoaster, of the, uh, this is, this is, I mean, great stuff here, um, yeah, and for all the guys knowing the original Space Mountain and uh, Disneyland, uh, this isn't the layout, I know, this is just some layout made by me, and uh, this is also made just at this point here, because afterwards, when fitting in the roof, I thought it might be a little bit better to have the final layout before, um, I'm not too happy with the layout, uh, to be honest, um, afterwards, because it is kind of a good layout, but there are some parts in it where it isn't that smooth as I wished it to be. Um, but I haven't spent too much time on the layout, uh, to be fair, as you can see here. This is also the end of the episode. And it's me again. Um, yeah, this was the end of the first episode and uh, um, I thought I might just do a little ending take here because um, I just was interrupted and a little bit surprised by um, the end of this episode and to be honest I was also quite kind of happy with the recording before so I thought I may save it just by doing such a kind of end, end screen here and um, yeah, I hope you like it. Um, and. If you want to uh, see how it will go on in the future, just subscribe and follow the stream. Um, yeah, have a nice day then and bye.